so welcome to my youtube channel so i am dr prashant upadhyay and today i will going to tell you how to do the connection of the bmp280 sensor and how to check the what is the address of the bmp280 sensor so in general what happen is that when you are connecting the bmp280 sensor you have to know what is the address of the bmp280 where you will going to connect it we have got the i2c scanner file available and you can download it from the internet or even the link given below so it will going to give you the address of the bmp280 so this is the connection of the bmp280 sensor with the arduino uno board so you can see that uh, we are giving the supply of 3.3 volt and we are connecting it with the arduino 3.3 volt then we have got a ground so we are making a connection to the ground and then we have got the scl pin so we are connecting it with the a5 of the arduino uno board and then we have got a sda that we are connecting with the a4 of the arduino uno board okay so this is the diagram which we are using and on the right side you can see that actual arduino uno board connections with the bmp280 sensor so it's a very small program you can see so you can see that uh, i have opened a serial monitor and it is saying no i2c device found that means my bmp which was i have connected was not able to detect so right now you can see that the bmp280 sensor which i am using is in the loose contact okay they are not solder okay so when you are buying the bmp280 sometime you can get the so uh, bmp280 which has been shoulder completely and uh, sometime you will be getting the pins and the chips which are been not shoulder okay so it always be advised that uh, when you are connecting the bmp280 on the breadboard so make sure that the connection is been done properly so that the board can be easily detected by the arduino uno boards i hope the connections are clear to now you can see it is saying that i2c device found at address 0 cross 76 so this is the bmp address which we have to give in our programming so you can see it is saying scan started i2c device found at address 0 cross 76 scan finished okay so first thing you have to do whenever you are connecting the sensors that you have to find out that what is the valid address of that particular sensors okay so sometime if the sensor is giving the different position so you have to connect the sensors on that particular address